Welcome back. This is the showing off of the Fruits Basket Collector's Edition Volume 7. It just came out on the 22nd of November. Um, let's just get into this thing. So, of course, you got the front with Ritsu on it. It's really nice looking. And of course, we got the back with Rin or Isuzu. It's a really nice picture as well. And then, of course, we got the spine with Isuzu and Rin. And it's a really nice green color. I like I like this shade of green that they have. It's it's not like the dark green that you see during Christmas. It's more of like a spring green. That's that's how I describe this color. It's like a springish green. Either way, it's really nice. Um, so we got opened up, and we got of course we got little Ritsu, who's in monkey form. We got the colored pages. This one's probably my favorite right here, or one of my favorites right here, because you get the you get the entire um, get the entire camp school defense force right there, and it's it's fun. There's another one of them that I think pops up later on that I really like as well. Uh, and then then we have this super cute picture of Toru and Kisa. That's just adorable. Um, and then of course we have the original covers for volumes uh, 13 and 14. This picture, and then this the chapter index picture, and then it just starts with the manga. Uh, this is the volume, um, and it's pretty much the same as it always is. Um, however, the ending is a bit different. Not the ending, but like the in back content is a little bit different than the previous volumes. So you got the um, the final page and the volume. I've got the thank you page. And it kind of shuts off with normal, and it's like, oh, okay, there's the translator's notes, and then it has the, uh, oh, we're going to do the random thing to show the black and white versions of the cover page. Which, again, they randomly do. But then they decide to, oh, we're going to give a couple page preview for volume eight. Which is like, which is uh, the start of you find which is ch start of chapter eighty four and you finding out uh, the very beginning of Yuki's backstory. Um, and other than that, it's just the preview for um, for other not too popular series. And then it's the end, and then it's little, and then it's uh, Isuzu in her horse form. Um, but other than that, that's really about it. Um. Again, I again I had the I posted the previous video of the, the stuffed plushies, which I was super excited about. Um, the only other things coming up, of course, is that um, the first basket Blu-ray is being released tomorrow in Japan on the 23rd. However, the funny thing is, is that uh, CD Japan, where I had pre-ordered off of, has already sent has already um, it's already it's already being sent to me like it. it was they gave, they sent me an email saying oh we shipped it to you uh, yesterday starting yesterday so that's on its way so I'm excited about that. that that potentially means I might have it in by Friday maybe don't count on it 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 will most definitely be in sometime next week unless of course the whole tsunami earthquake thing does something in which but it's already said it's being shipped over. It's already past being there in Trent. Anyway, so that's going to be coming up, and then of course the next volume, volume 8, comes out I think um, it's going to be December. It's going to be it's like really close to Christmas that it comes out. Other than that, it's just a comparison uh, between the English and Japanese volume 7 of the collector's edition. Um, but other than that, that's about it. So, uh, see you guys in a couple days or so. And, uh, bye for now.